All right, we are back playing more Hunter the Reckoning here. Uh, we got pretty far in our first stream of this. Love taking this trip down memory lane with this and uh, getting further than I ever have. I really don't remember how far I got. I thought it was just the teddy bear boss, but that was pretty early in the game, so. I feel like I, I did get by there at one point, but don't remember. Anyways, we're gonna continue with this and see if we can beat the game, pretty much. We should have plenty of lives left. Um, as far as the level lists go, I think we're near the end of the game. Or at least close to it. Uh, we gotta go back to Judge. So it keeps our XP, there we go. We gotta be Judge. Such a good game though, guys. Highly recommend this one. And I just ordered the sequel, Hunter the Reckoning Wayward, for PS2 today off eBay for $10. I was jumped on that because I had no idea that one existed. I do have Redeemer, which is the third in the series, apparently, on original Xbox, which I could play on my 360 because my original Xbox does not work anymore. Um, so here's where we left off. Take a look around. Our health's pretty low. Zoom the camera out so you can see what I'm doing. So thank you for joining me. Those who watched part one or stopped by the stream. Oh, gosh, thank you. Oh, what the hell was that? Oh, crap. This dog's going to kill me. Oh, my gosh. I couldn't switch to my weapon quick enough. Twelve lives remain. Okay. we got to keep tabs on that. Anything over here? Oh, sh what the heck? I hate these dogs. They're pain. They kill you so quickly. And they're so fast. They're impossible to get away from. There's another one? Oh, and another one! What? It's like the Resident Evil Mansion, and it's gonna be all dogs coming out. Uh, my gosh, they get too close, I can't hit them. No, I don't want that weapon. Gosh darn it. All I have is this. Oh, we're being tested here early. I just want to get this gun that's over here. These dogs keep coming, though. I can't see. See, I can't... Oh, my gosh. Give me health. Give me health! They literally keep coming over there, so I'm gonna, like not go over there anymore. This is like the endless spawn point for these dogs. Easily the worst villain in the game here because these things though I don't know how we kill them. I died again. I've already died twice on this level. That's not good. It's not good. Helen, Celeste, Marie, and Jeffrey Dengenhart, the third, are all buried here. The warden's entire family was wiped out on the same day, 1926. That would make the warden over 100 years old. So this is like a... Oh. Look at this. There's the key, there's the key. Come on. I need more like ammo and stuff. Look at the reach on these things, by the way. Oh my goodness me. I can't move. More Look at all the dogs. All my lives are gonna be gone. I can't hit them. Oh my gosh, this is so annoying. 
Thank goodness there's a health health cliff right there. I just I need more ammo for my guns because there's no way. All these dogs are everywhere. Back to the health glyph. No, there's another. I got this thing whipping its hair back and forth at me. You think there's enough dogs here? I mean, seriously. I think they could have put in at least a couple more dogs. I don't think there's enough dogs here. Give me a couple more. Get out of my face with these dogs. Oh my god. <laughs> I got this freaking thing whipping back and forth. Gosh, this level's hard already. I have like no ammo for anything either. Let's just get in, let's just get into the mansion or whatever. Before we die again. Oh my gosh. Intense start to this one. There's like 50 dogs after me, then guys shoot me, those things whipping around, other things chasing me. Look, as soon as I get in here. Wow. What, what, what do I do? I got nothing. I have a chainsaw. I'm dead. I'm so dead. Yeah. Eleven lives remain. I can't even get one shot off here. Holy crap. What is that whipping thing so it's just, yeah, I don't know, <laughs> but it's annoying me, and it won't stop. This is so hard, but it's just the last, this has gotten the last parts of the game. Like, they're hitting me with every enemy imaginable. Killing that freaking thing. What do I have? I have 24 shots with the shotgun. I have... I have nothing else. I have no more chainsaw left either. Can I break open this box? Yes, I can. Nothing inside. Come on. I forgot that you could smash things too in this game, but not really anything around. <laughs> this level is killing me. I only have 11 lives left, so... We're like literally in the Resident Evil Mansion too. Look at, look at the damage they do. Need that health. Died again. They have like perfect aim. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get much further in this game if it's going to be like this. Okay, at least I'm getting some ammo here. I don't have the right key for this door. Great, there's going to be... Uh, it's going to be a maze too. Right key for this door. How many keys am I gonna need? I I go in here. As soon as I get in here, key's been dropped. Great. Did I just get out of here? I'm just getting out of here. Found a key. There's a whole area. Is that where I came from? That is where I came from. Why did they completely switch the camera on me? I don't have the right key for that door, so now I gotta go into the next door. This door's next. 
We got these jumping vampire chicks all over here. Look at them. Whoa! We can wipe off my wipe out my health in no time. There we go. Get the key. Get the health. Save the person. <sighs> I got a lot of ammo for the machine guns, so I probably want to just get that out. Time for the next door. Whoa. Alright, so there's that. Alright, we're not going in that door yet. We've been in that door. Uh, we were in that door. I think probably this door is next, huh? Yeah. Yes. Get the key. Save the person in case we can get a free guy for that. Okay. Alright. Alright, now we're out. And now we probably have a key for the main door. I'm gonna go refill my energy down here. Hopefully. That's good enough. Get me out of here. Alright, so what door... It's gotta be this one at the end. <laughs> Can't remember which doors I haven't been in yet. I think it's this one. Yep. There, 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 there. Stop it. They don't die. <laughs> okay, I don't care about Dingle Heart's journey or journal, whatever. Can I go in there now? <laughs> My lord. What a level, this is like a gauntlet here. Pete Door is streaming, it says. He's been streaming a lot. I usually host Pete Door, guys, you know. Pete Door has no idea who I am, but I like his channel, so I always host him, too. Or Evil Serial. I try to host uh, you as well, Jesse, and uh, I should set up. I think it might be set up for ghost hosts and multi apples. I hope. If not, I'm gonna have to do that. Let's go in here. Pete Thor, he'll be streaming horror stuff all month. That's something that he does. Get out of and he's got a much bigger library of games than I do. Enough blood in here. Leave me be. Dagenhart, I want to know what is going on. Yeah, tell you me. You were here when Arcady was executed, just as I was. He's still there, haunting the death row. I can't get anywhere near him or do anything about it. He's your link. Now go. Nathaniel Arcady and the other prisoners suffered enough because of you. I won't let you hurt anyone else. Oh. Oh, look at this. You don't seem to understand. They came in here. They killed my family. They made me into this thing. I didn't want it. I didn't ask for it. I had no choice. Whoa. Do you know how much I sacrificed? I have nothing left. I started this company. Welcome to eternity. Uh oh, this might be, is this like the, the last? His army looks broken yet. Is this like the final boss or something? Oh, shoot! Whoa! There's an innocent in here? How do I get out of the way of that? 
I'm not gonna beat this guy. This might be the final boss. What? How am I supposed to get out of that? Uh, I only have like 10 lives left too, which is not a lot of it feel like against this. This is like doing almost nothing to him too. There we go. Oh, that definitely damaged him. That was good. Shoot. But if I jump when he does that, I can kind of get away from it. He's got his tentacle arm. Yeah. Yeah, you have to jump. There was more ammo in here somewhere. It comes down to this, guys. Alright, what's next? What's next? I'm gonna have to start using this thing. It's gonna take forever to kill him. Oh my gosh, this is gonna take forever. If I even survive it. Does this do good damage to him? Not really. I'm trying to preserve my lives as much as I can here. Yeah, that's not doing anything. That's gonna get me killed quicker. This guy's definitely broken. Darn it. Ten lives left. Holy shoot. Get up. He hits me while I'm down. It's so cheap. Alright, we managed to heal up again. I'm saving my other gun for later on if it comes down to it. I'll work him down with this. This is going to take forever, though. As long as I can't see. I'm dead. I'm dead. Get up. Oh, I'm out, I'm out of charges with that, so it's, now it's just I have what I have left here. But I do have... More of that left. Have some of that. If I can get him with that a couple more times. Yes. Every time I die, I think it recharges, so. Boom. Alright, hold on. Let me get my gun out now. This is gonna be cool. It's not doing much. Wow, but aiming looks hard in this game. It's not too bad. You have full range. You have full range of aiming with the C stick, so you can kind of run and aim at the same time. Nice. Uh, let's get him with this when we can. It's not uh, the camera angles not helping me at all here. He's dead. He's he's dead. We got him. No. Yes. Some of that, you bastard. So we had a lot of lives there at the end, so... <laughs> we were lucky. Is that the last boss? I don't know if that's the last boss, but it just kind of seemed like it. Huh? But maybe not. Probably, oh, I guess not. As a boss, great. I'm not gonna have a lot of lives now. Whatever happens next. Shoot. Now where am I going? I honestly have no idea what I'm doing now. The 
with the gun suspended in midair there. Do I like leave the mansion now? Like what? I guess so. <laughs> Tentacle arms man is dead. So there we go. As long as I don't have to fight the teddy bear again. Make your way to death row. Arcadia's possession and execution freed the spirits last year. Killing him may close the hole. Whoa! Make our way back. Let's go see get any ammo we can. So I guess we gotta make our way back to the prison. Oh, I got the, these freaking jumping. Oh, the, the dogs are back. I just wanna heal up. I just wanna heal up. Get me out of here. Wow, they're appearing every, like, <sighs> I made it, oh my god, <laughs> I hate the dogs, oh my gosh, they're relentless, there's like 50 of them after me, what am I supposed to do? I don't want to waste all my ammo on them. Just to die. I just save and get to the next area. Okay. Again, I have no idea where I'm going here. Look at... <laughs> There's just people everywhere. This is, this is crazy. Darn it, I died right before I got to hell. Oh, that was awesome. There's too many things to fight. He aims the wrong way. What the? I... I don't, I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> to the door. No? <laughs> Jesse, you want to tap in here? Please? I can't go through that door either. So where am I going? In there? No. I bet one of these damn enemies has a key on you or something stupid. They're just appearing. I kill one and they just appear right away. I probably have like eight lives left, maybe seven. Oh my gosh. There's no way. I thought that one guy might have been the last boss, but nope. That guy dropped the gun. No health, no health. Thank you very much. Actually, I'm gonna... For a second, I'm turn down the volume a little bit. That's the key. Okay. <laughs> Tag you in. You're not much help though. I don't care. Anything will do right now. This is this is where I definitely need like multiplayer going on. <laughs> I need that couch co-op. Uh, I don't know. I got out of there without dying. <sighs> on to the next area. This must be entertaining for you guys, though.
Fifty of them. Back in the freaking prison. Oh my gosh. I take one more shot. I'm dead. I need health. There it is. Uh, seven lives left. Okay. Uh, you always need a key to get through every door. Drop more ammo. Or the key. I'll take either one. Come on. No key yet. What is that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. There, there. They're still... I got them. Oh, they're still alive. I think the shotgun kills them. It does. My goodness. Now, what's in here? Innocent. Five innocents remain. They better give me free guys for this. Okay, these hangman ghosts need to stop. It's a little insane. Mm. Open. Machine gun. I'm going to get everything I can. All right, let's get the machine gun out. Look at this. At least I can kill them with ammo. Real weapons. How many enemies keep appearing? I, I don't stand a chance here. Oh my gosh. Every time I open one of these, like 50 more of these guys come in. Oh, nice. That was a good shot. Three left. <laughs> Anything in there? No? No ammo or nothing? Something in there. How come I don't have any free guys for this? Shoot. I can't tell if there's anything in those cells or not. There's health in here. Is that somebody in there? It is. <laughs> Look at the scenes here. Look at the scenes you have from this area. I don't know if there's anything in there. There's like a hundred things after me right now. Wow. Wow.
Get out of Judge's way. Judge is a badass. Hey, you want some of this? Crossbow's not too bad on these guys if you can get a couple of them in there. There's still one more innocent to save here. I don't think they're gonna stop coming though. stop coming are they so where is this oh my gosh where's this last innocent not in there I'm gonna drop some blue orbs for me Says there's one more innocent to save, and we've been in all these cells except for one. But I don't see anything in that other one. I'll go in. What? Where are they all coming from now? Can I kill them with this? Yeah, I think it just knocks them back. Yeah, it doesn't actually kill them. Shotgun does kill them though. <laughs> that was great. Hell yes. Mm. Better not be cells on this side. Okay, good. So many enemies now. Where's the other innocent? No, this guy's gonna kill me. There's no more innocents in there, what? I've been in every cell. I'm not sure. like hiding underneath the bed or something I don't know if we can know where they are Are they in here? Wow They are Alright now get me out of here I bet you the keys in here too probably Let's get the uh, machine gun out I get awarded a, a free guy. I, sh I should have, huh? Oh, come on. I'm trying to leave and make more appear. Give me a break. Get out of my face. I 
I see you're still going. Good to see. Yes, we are back. Still going with this Onyx. Do you know, are we near the end of the game here? Or we still have a ways to go? I mean, I have like seven or eight lives left or something like that. So I don't know if I'll be able to last, but we'll see. Alright, next checkpoint. Oh, it's getting really hard now because there's just so many enemies. Well, I got a flamethrower too, so let's... I kind of want to save that, though. Now, where am I going here? Darn it, I, they appear like right as where I'm walking. Like, that's so cheap. Gun? Hard to say. The penitentiary is a big part of the game and always ends up being longer than you remember. Okay. So we might still have a ways to go. Uh, look at look. George has improved his skills. Yeah, better after all this. Get that, get that. Let's see if I can farm back some, uh, some health here. I have no ammo left for this. Darn it, I didn't. Uh, I, have, like, I have no good ammo right now. Oh my god, these things keep coming. There, 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 there. My best means of attack right, right now. Oh, that thing just drained like all my health. I don't think that kills those either. <laughs> Is this... There's too many freaking things. Wow. Almost died there. I'm gonna die here though. I need a key. Should have known. Uh, ten lives though. So I got a few extra lives from saving his innocence. That's good. Still no key drop. Do I need to go in these cells? None of these open. So where's the key then? None of these bastards have the key. I need the key! I don't think I got the key amongst all that chaos. No. Well, what am I doing then? Like, one of these enemies could have it for all I know. Come back out here, I guess. I don't know. 
They just decide when you get the key. Can't go any further. That's a dead end too. I mean, where's the key? Any day now would be nice to give me that key drop. This crossbow is certainly getting a little more powerful as he levels up. Drop the key, there we go. Gosh. Oh shoot, this guy's back. This is not good. Oh no. No, I don't care about that. He has no health bar. I'm gonna die over there. I'm stuck. Get me out of there. Great. I don't want to fight this bastard again. There was a health glyph over there too. Oh, I could have saved a life. Well, next checkpoint. <laughs> Don't tell me that we're about to fight the teddy bear again. <laughs> we shall see, guys. This game's so good. It's getting really hard, but it's so good. This, this catwalk will take you to the prison infirmary building. Enter through the roof find a way to death row on the catwalk yeah oh all right let's just try and find our way I'm gonna have a quick look for some ammo and stuff looks like there's a lot of room to roam the worst is when they just appear right as you're walking there like makes it impossible to dodge Alright, nothing over here. Let's just go. Uh, as long as the dogs don't show up. Very good. Right. Wow. That lady just drained my health. <clears throat> Gargoyle. I'm not going to worry too much about them unless I need to get, get a key again. Okay, so here's a way. It flashed so fast, how am I supposed to read that? Oh my gosh, I'm never going to find my way around. thing. See, I'm going to need a key. So I'm probably going to need to kill every freaking thing here. Oh my gosh. There. I'll do some damage. This is cool though, I got a lot of area to roam around. Jump over these. Shoot, shoot. There. I don't know if any of these bastards are gonna drop that key I need. Go, go, go. They just keep coming. Let me get the energy. Let's see if there's like ammo hiding behind here. No. I 
Oh my gosh. Get cornered and Just go, just go. Alright. So I know it's not that way. through here. Rocket launcher, all right. We haven't gotten that before. One of you has the key. There's a gun in there I want. Well, I guess I don't need that. I'll use it now. Almost dead. Give me health. Darn it, ten lives. Yeah, I got a few lives from saving those people, so getting all this ammo over here. If anything, I can come back there and get shotgun ammo. My gosh, they just keep... <laughs> it just doesn't stop. I think anyone could have the key, too. Any one of these. Trying to run away again. This flamethrower guy. See, look at that. They really drain your health. The freaking machine gun. Wow, I gotta do this to get out of here. They all like followed me over here. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> you, have a ho you have enough lives, fingers crossed. And Onyx says hope. Yeah, I hope so too, guys. I don't know. I really don't know if I'm gonna have enough to get through this. Oh my gosh. Especially this part, I have no idea like where I'm going here. I'm trying to find a key. key somewhere from one of these. It's a card because like another innocent save because they just keep respawning so I don't know if there's like a specific enemy type that I should be going for for the key. Like look at this. They're just dropping in left, right, and center. Alright, let me kill some of these bastards and we'll see if we can... Uh... Oh, she's gonna die. Somebody drop a key for me. Please. Oh, 
Onyx. I was, um, you were in here a little bit earlier, but uh, I actually ordered uh, Hunter Wayward uh, off eBay today for PS2. It was really cheap, so thank you for telling me about that game, and I jumped on getting it because I really, really love these games. So I'll attempt to play through all three of them. I don't know when we'll get to Wayward. It might not be this month just because I have a lot of other horror games, but um, we will certainly be going for that at some point. Jesse, help me. <laughs> Look at my health. Nobody wants to drop a uh, key for me here. Now let's get the uh, machine gun out again. Oh, that's the rocket launcher. I just killed myself. Oh, I thought that was the machine gun. Gosh darn it. <laughs> that was a waste of a life. Cool. Look forward to it. Yeah, have you beaten all three of the games, Onyx? I assume, it seems like you, you certainly know the series pretty well. I don't even know Wayward existed until I... As, as always, I thought Redeemer was the sequel, but that's the third, so I'd have to wait to play that one. Uh, did we go... This is the way we came from here. We went this way, right? I can't believe I killed myself with a rocket launcher. <laughs> Jesse, you need the help, though. Moral support, at least, you're here. Uh -huh. I'm, like, I could be doing this all night. I don't know who's got the key. If they keep appearing, it's not gonna matter. Who I kill? Like, really, are they gonna stop? Yeah, I've beaten them, but not since, like, the original release. Otherwise, I occasionally watch streamers on YouTube or playthroughs to refresh me. Cool. So, yeah, that's... You have definitely have experience beating these. That's cool. Um, I said I had gotten this... Probably, I mean, I got a used copy of this, like, probably not too long after it had been out back in the day. I played this a lot, but I never, never beat it. Never got, I never got too far in the game. But I, I would always play with my friends or my brothers. You know, I'd never played too much by myself. It's so much harder like this. All right, like what? I'm going in circles now. Who's got the key? Might be one of those gargoyle bastards. This shotgun's great. Need that health. Come on. They're, they're just gonna keep coming, huh? Maybe I can farm some kind of health. Darn it, they just keep appearing right on me. Makes it impossible to dodge. I think I may have cleaned out this area. Let's go take a look. Well, we'll see, Jesse, we'll see. If I got this, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, like I said at the beginning of the uh, first stream of this, we'll get as far as we can. I am farming for a little bit of health.
same time, I'm kind of hoping they don't appear anymore so I know I have an area cleared out where I don't have to come back to looking for the key. Oh, this guy is still over here. There. See, when I play Wayward or whatever, it's going to be different because I'm going to be playing the, th the trilogy on three different systems, so I'm gonna be, I'm so used to playing this on GameCube. Um, the second one will be on PlayStation 2, I'll have to get used to the way the controls work there, and then the third one I'll have to play on Xbox, technically Xbox 360. Um, so it's gonna be, uh, it's gonna be interesting. But we'll see, maybe we'll start Wayward during this month at some point. Depends on how quickly we get through some other horror games. Um, I am going to be hooking up the PS2 anyways to play some good horror stuff, so... Alright, a little more health. Yeah, we've pretty much cleaned out this area here. Literally, we probably have to kill every last enemy here. That's what it seems like, huh? Alright, so... Good, give me health, give me health. Yeah, look at that, they literally appear right, right when walking. I hate that. Onyx, have you ever played uh, Victor Vron? This kind of reminds me of that in a way. Or Victor Vron kind of reminds me of this in a way. Uh, Victor Vron's a pretty cool game. I got that for free on Xbox One. and it was um, It's hard. I, I didn't beat it. I got to the final boss, but I couldn't beat him. I think I need to be a higher level. If you haven't played Victor Vron, you might like that one. You have not. Okay. Which game are you most excited to play? For Horror Month? Um, honestly, I was really excited to play this one because I'm coming back to this. But, uh, it's gotta be. I'm looking forward to really delving into Silent Hill 2 one of these nights. Because I haven't beaten that game and that game's creepy as all hell. That was a waste. The rocket launcher again. Shoot. I mean, the rocket launcher might work on those things too. Let me see. I want to blow myself up again. Come on, where is it? There it is. Boom. Yeah, it does. Full health again. Um, and depends on what other ones. Like I said, I have a few games on the way. Um, I'm actually really looking forward to playing Wayward now since I've never played that one. So I don't have time for everything. I always love playing Alan Wake. We've been playing a couple episodes of that. I just love horror games. I can't. I can't get enough of them. I'm trying to stuff as many as we can into them month. Record as much content as I can for you guys. And I promise that episode of Horror Night is coming. And I want to try and get maybe one more episode done in the month as well. I just don't know what the topic will be yet. 
Like, I don't know what to do, because it's just like, everything just keeps coming. Missed him. What was that shot? Right, I gotta get a better shot here. There we go. Look at, they just keep coming. Somebody has to have the freaking key. trying to do on the channel right now all month long. I love it. That's why I've been watching some horror themed things already. Playing horror games all month long. I don't think I'm going to stream one thing this month that isn't horror related. Looks like the enemies are starting to die down over here, too. What the heck? Oh, one appeared right in front of me as I was trying to walk. Like, I hate that. Would that be any cheaper? Improving my skills too, so that's good. So kill him quicker now. Okay. Yeah. Alright, what? Is there anything left over here? Is there anything left? Nothing. There's a really cute um, Halloween RPG that came out years ago on 360 that I kind of want to play. Um, unfortunately, there's no physical copies of it because I would love one. It's called um, Costume Quest. And if you want a game that puts you in the Halloween mood, play that game. I only played a little bit. I have the demo, that's it. So I might see how much that is because I think it's backwards compatible with the Xbox One. I might see how much that is and play that. Um, a little indie game. There was a sequel too, but I want to play the first one. Because it literally puts you in a neighborhood with all these little Halloween decorations and you're this kid going around trick-or-treating and you gotta find candy and then you gotta, your battles are you kinda have like big battles with you know your costume against their costume kinda like they, they go into like big mode and fight. It's pretty cool. You get like quests around the neighborhood. It's called Costume Quest. And I think you can kind of like customize your character, if I'm not mistaken. And how they look. In terms of like what they're wearing. So if you guys are interested in that, maybe we'll, maybe we'll play that again. I don't know. I don't, like what enemies are even left now? But we have to kill every single one. Uh, keys. One of you bastards has to have the key.
Get off of me. Come on. Who has the key? This is insane. I'm fighting enemies for like an hour. Testing my stamina right now. It's been an hour stream, and 45 minutes of it has been in this one level trying to find this key. Let's see if we can get up here. Is there anything up here? I mean, we're totally wiping out most of the enemies. You probably have to kill every enemy. So it seems like. The very last one will drop the key. Just try not to die here. It's a good spot to stand. Where I was. Can I actually hit them from up there? So I feel like maybe. Oh yeah, I can still hit them, yeah. It's good. <laughs> As I kill everything and then I go up there. Make things harder on myself. So we can get up here first. Where is this freaking key? Now they're just sporadically coming in. Some farm and some health back. That's gonna be one of these gargoyle things, isn't it? Uh, another one. Rocket launcher time. Don't tell me an enemy way back here has it. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. I still have the rocket launcher on me. Darn it. Probably somebody back here that has the freaking key I need. I hope not. Great. It's so good when you get a big chunk of them. I don't know, I'm gonna kill all these enemies too because I might need to. Somebody drop a damn key. <laughs> getting insane now. Oh my gosh, right, you know what?
absolute marathon here. Convinced this might not end. Let's get the crossbow back out for these guys. Ugh. They just appear on like on top of you. So you're like forced to take damage even when you, you can't do anything about it. As cheap as you like. shooting I can get through this. I'm trying. I'm trying. I mean, wait, how many enemies have I killed on this level alone do you think? Probably around 500 at least. It's gonna be the very last enemy I kill that gives me my Alright, can I get him now? No? Still more? What else is alive out there, huh? Gonna be the new hot spot. It's one of the longer, more tedious levels in the game. The general idea is to kill everything, get a key, do the next section of the rooftop. So it probably is gonna be. You'd, oh, you just checked a walkthrough. It looks like you're right. So yeah, you do have to kill everything. <laughs> so we're gonna be. I mean, the good thing is we're leveling up, but bad news is we died twice because of the rocket launcher. And it's just eating up all of our ammo for our good weapons. And it's just taking forever. I mean, where else do I need to go here for these enemies? to get the uh, rocket launcher out here. There's another one. And another one. What else? Like, what else is out here? <laughs> you have to, like, walk around the whole map because they spawn at random points. So you gotta make sure you trigger all their their spawns. I mean, if there's nothing but the gargoyles left, then I run out of ammo for my rocket launcher, and I don't have enough magic power. There'll be no way I can kill them unless I die purposely, so I can refill my magic meter, which would be very annoying. But. I think we killed everything there. Now the game's starting to test my sanity. I think I've proved my longevity. Now let's test my sanity while we're at it, huh? something spawn.
This is asking a lot from the player right now. Like, I think I've killed enough guys to earn myself a key, I think. I, I think so, by now. <laughs> Pretty sure a thousand guys killed is, uh, warrants a key. <laughs> Alright, now we go back over this way. Should I go up here again? Let's go check down this way. There was one guy up there that I needed to get. Uh. Alright, moving on. The hostages are just ahead. I already saved a bunch of people here. Should I kill everything already? Or... Because I don't know if I'm going to need another key. They're killing them. I just saved a whole bunch of them though. There's like vampire chicks everywhere. They killed they killed a few of them, but I, I managed to save I think like four or five of them. I think I might have got three guys for this. They're all gonna die. Get out of here. I'm pissed now. Face, die. What the heck? I was like frozen there. I couldn't move. And she is not dying. Pissing me off. Right, there we go. I just start killing as much as I can. You don't like the scream? Scream's the best part. <sighs> dead. Dead. Uh, this was like a dead end, actually. So we probably do have to kill everything here. Let's get the shotgun out. Stunning. Hope I got at least one free guy with all those saves I just made. They're dropping ammo though for the uh, machine gun. The machine gun doesn't really kill them quick enough though. At all. Let me turn down the volume a little bit more. It's getting late where I am, so... Alright, now what? <gasps> Save point, thank goodness.
What do you think, Lebowski? I think they could have done with a few more villains in that last level, huh? What is this thing now with the freaking Popeye arm? Freaking Popeye the Sailor Man come back from hell. Where am I anyways? Like this is this is the prison? Looks like an insane asylum or whatever. Oh this freaking thing again? As always, guys, I have no idea where I'm going. What is... That thing died quicker than any enemy in the game. One step at a time, indeed. Thank God for saves. Yeah, I'm glad, you know. This is something on, like, NES or something. You wouldn't have those, you know, save states like you would. I don't know if I have to fight all this. We'll try. Alright, he's dead. These things are becoming a big problem. The projectiles. Such range on it. I think we saved the person over there. Again, I don't know if I need a key from one of these things. That monster is terrifying. Which one? The big one that came after me or the one that was on like two legs? Or these Popeye things? I think they're kind of goofy. Oh, they're going to kill me. Was close. I need health. I'm not dropping any health for me. Just a little bit. Whoa! 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 Let me guess, I need a key to do anything. Find the key. Oh my gosh. Not this again. And why do you do that? Alright, 11 lives remain. I did get a few lives. Always go and save the innocents because you get free lives for that. A live saved is a live gain. Out of ammo. So once again, we're gonna have to kill every stupid thing looking for a key. What? Die. <sighs> Might have to do with another night of this game too, guys, because this is getting it's getting hard. But uh we have to come back to it again. Which is fine, this game's really good. It's just that uh, these levels are getting insane. I guess we should kill everything in here first to start off. Come on. And if 
die again. they shoot me from no I got stuck on the enemies I need to turn around I went the wrong way all right here we go again guys All these enemies have ranged attacks too, so this is not good. I'm trying to dodge left, right, and center, but I'm just gonna keep killing me. This is insane. They don't even die in those blasts. So I'm going to clear out this room so I don't have to come back here. So nothing else spawns. I go through the room like twice to see nothing else spawning. I think we're good. Be some more stuff through this hall, though. Yeah. I hate it. Oh my gosh, they just appear right where you are every time. <laughs> How am I supposed to dodge that? Like, look at... They're like appearing and attacking me as they appear. It's like, well, thanks, but, you know. It gives me absolutely zero chance dodging it. Enough of this hallway, come on. <sighs> oh my goodness! Nine lives, that's it. Might seem like a lot, but it doesn't seem like a lot to me. I know there's gonna be at least one more ridiculous boss fight I'm gonna have to try and get through. Prove my skills, great. How about my key finding skills at me? Alright. Come on! That's it with this area now. That's it. So that's the door to the right of the door we need to go into. Maybe we can finish clearing this room here. Get the ammo. Get 
heal up. There's all these doors to go into. <laughs> now I'm gonna cry. Look at it, it's already waiting for me to go in there. Sorry guys, I'm leaning back a bit here because I'm like, I know we're in in for the long haul here. I'm glad I don't have to get up early tomorrow. <sighs> Grab the coffee guys, get yourselves a cup of tea. Get those snacks. Grab that beer. Clear out this room. And I'll worry about the other doors. I think we're already in this door to, to the left here. Let's clear out that room too. So we already got started on that. Come on. It just it, it's like too many. Like they just one or two appear after a while. It's like what's the point? Like. The fact that they respawn in certain areas only when you go there makes it really hard to, to find every single one. So you have to scour every inch of the, the map. Alright, let's go back in here and finish this area. Another is that a monster or a save? Oh, it's a save thing. That's good. I thought we were in this room already. Maybe I'm thinking of a different door we went in. All right, let's get out. Just for now. Completed this room. I wonder if that person respawned or something. That was weird. They gave us a chance to. We might have gotten an extra life for that too. So that's good. certainly designed for more people to play these later levels especially because so many things to fight taking out every en enemy by yourself it's quite the task this doesn't feel like a prison though I mean, this kind of feels like a psych ward or something I think we're done in here. I hope. I guess let's go to this door next. Uh, every room's like the same thing again, too, which is very annoying. that we have to fight and kill every single one of these freaking things. I 
I've only, I'm only in an hour and a half, really, of, of streaming tonight. I feel like I've been playing this game for about four hours. <laughs> Give me some health. As soon as you get your health, it's gone because they appear right in the next spot that you stand, so they hit you. See? See, look at that. It's so cheap. It must be convenient for them to be able to appear right on me. So they get their hits off. done. This is... <laughs> That's unfair. I know, isn't it? It's so unfair. Why do they do that? There's another life to be saved here. Whoa, he, he jumped right on me. Like, what? What was I going to do about that? And then he killed me. I couldn't move. Nine lives remain. I hope this guy has the key. I have like no ammo for any of these guns. There. Of course he doesn't have the key. Why would he? What is this thing? It's a health one. Right? <sighs> Jesse, are you playing uh, Stranded Deep tonight at all? Did you play that tonight yet? Are you playing it right now? <laughs> Alright, so. Any more suckers over here? After this, we'll have just one more room to clear, so we're getting there, guys. One of these bastards got the key. Come on. It's the worst when they appear on you when you're trying to walk towards, like, an orb to, to heal yourself. And they hit you. You can't do anything about it. You're not playing it right now. Did you play it earlier though? You said you were playing it last night for a while. I do want to play that game. Like I said, it was recommended to me a while ago. And it's a game I've known about for years, but I just haven't gotten around to playing it at all. Because it looks like something we could do, depending on how long we could survive, is like an open-ended series as well. We could always come back to. Um, I'm pretty sure there's physical versions of it too, so that also entices me to want to get it more. And there's a physical version to put into the collection. Whoa. Great, great. These freaking things. the heel glyph again. Oh, come on! Do you guys know any other game that literally has enemies that appear right on you where you're walking so you get hit? Like, that is the cheapest thing. <laughs> That's like the one bad complaint I'd have about this game. Everything else is just quality. Such a good game. 
But that one little thing there, they just appear on you. It's so cheap. Like that. Like that. Like that. Like that. <laughs> There you go, see, it just keeps happening. It's just... You think I'd like it, uh, Stranded Deep? I, I know, I definitely would. It's a very fun, fun game. Nope, just this one is the only one with the sp enemies that spawn on top of you. Practically inside me. Look at this hallway, we're never gonna finish this. This type of game you could have a blast, like couch co-op, got four players playing this, you just go around and kill everything, it'd be so much better. By myself I have to watch every step. Is that the end of them here? Come on. No more. I'm sure there's going to be more right here by the door. Alright. One more door. I'm probably going to end the stream at the next save point unless somebody knows that if that's like pretty much the end of the game, then I might be enticed to keep going. But if there's a lot more after this, I might call it a night soon. I like this sucker on fire. Tickers are coming after me. Darn it, that came up behind me. See, we do get extra lives for this couple people we saved, so we're back down to nine again. He's almost dead. Oh, come I jumped and he still got me. There we go. There's the key. Uh, I'm just going to run through here real quick to just see if there's anything that... Any people to save. Or any ammo for a weapon. Take a quick peek. These things are going to end up getting you killed again. There's a lot more after this. Best to save it for another night. Okay, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> There's still be more because this is only our second stream. I like. There's still gonna be more. Go. Alright. Darn it. Let's try and get some health back here. See him over there. Oh, they're gonna kill me. No! Wow. I, I'm not staying. I'm gonna end up just losing all my lives just doing this. I was trying to get health back, but those ticker things keep coming. Getting out of here. Goodbye. No, don't you dare. <laughs> okay, now we have the key. 
get some rest for your migraine. <laughs> uh, my, my migraine did not really do its damage too much, good because I, well, I took that um took that etc. And so it didn't really hit me. It's already subsiding the little headache that I did have. That's why I took it early because sometimes I can catch it before it gets bad. Otherwise, I probably wouldn't have been able to do this stream. All right, so we have a save point here. Let me just go use this heal glyph again. Such a excellent game, this though. These levels are getting much, much harder. Do I want to go to another checkpoint? I don't know. The fires have weakened the building structure. You have about six minutes to find the five people in here before your whole place collapses. You have to use the freight elevator to get to the lower level. I don't like the sound of that at all. I'm going to be timed. Six minutes. Six minutes, LFO, you're on. One minute and the earth begins to shake. Two minutes and my heart begins to quake. Yeah, maybe not tonight. I don't know, guys. Let's do it. What the hell? Let's get to another checkpoint. Maybe. Ah, this could end up killing me and costing me all my progress. Um, I have six minutes to find five people and I gotta use the freight elevator to get to the lower floor. Okay. Alright, I guess so we don't have to fight anything. There's no timer? They're not gonna give me any timer. I have no idea where the freight elevator is either. Is there any way to know, like, how much time I have left? Oh, this tells you how many lives you have left when you pause it and go to this. Okay. Darn it! There's one. <laughs> I thought that was a person, that's just a shotgun. Just a shotgun. Nobody in here? Hello? Alright, there's one. Oh, there's no way I'm sticking around to fight this stuff. Oh. Great. Oh, he died. So do I have six minutes or is it just like... Is it just telling me that as like a story or something? I don't... Oh, there's one in here. Three innocents. I'm just gonna keep working our way around the wall. Nothing there? That's the freight elevator, I guess. All right. Go, 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 go. I'm not gonna chance it. <laughs> oh, they are. They're over here. Darn it, okay. they, again, they just appear right where you're going. There's a weapon over here. Four minutes before collapse. Oh, we are being timed. We certainly are. Go, go, go. My controller just screwed up. I'm surprised this GameCube controller still works. Uh, this is like, this is the GameCube controller I had when I originally got my GameCube, and it is, still works fine. So if it starts to get a little janky, I can't really blame it. What in the fudge? Can't see where I'm going. 
What about in here? Oh, that's the freight elevator. Okay. Oh my gosh. Like, what happens if I don't complete this? Do I get a game over? I really hope not. Three minutes before the collapse. One innocent remains. Darn it! I'm gonna lose all my lives before I can even save everyone. <sighs> Go. This doesn't look good. No, none of this looks good right now. Barely getting away. Look at everything. <laughs> we gotta go back in that room. So we gotta remember which one is... Darn it, eight lives remain. So it's that one that's facing that way. Okay. We've we been in here yet. Stop it. Yeah, my joystick's actually starting to act up. It's weird. Is this the last innocent, please? Alright, go. Go. Watch, I'll probably need a key or something. Alright, we got it, we got it. Let's go. We're out of here. They don't give you any room for mistake here, huh? Better get those people saved and get the hell out of here. The worst is that the enemies that were chasing you before you leave are all waiting at the door when you go back in. See, look at this is where we gotta go. And they're just waiting to kill me. Get over there. Oh, they got me. So cheap. Let's get out of here. Alright, we did it. <laughs> that was uh that was crazy uh, yeah it was difficult you just gotta keep moving you really can't stop and fight things there you just gotta keep going alright that will be the checkpoint to end the night tonight but we got it it was a bit intense it was an onyx Ashcroft Penitentiary had more accidental deaths and all the prisons in the entire state combined looks like more of Dr. Hadrian's work. Okay. Alright, so when we come back in the next episode of this, we'll be here with Judge. Um, so I'll probably stream this again pretty soon. I don't know. Um, one of these nights, hopefully, or even during the day. This is more of a game I'd probably want to stream at night time. I like it at night here. Um, made some more good progress, and then we'll come back to this for sure. So do join me for that. Thank you so much, Jesse and Onyx, for being here, chatting. Everybody who may be checking out the video, as well as um, uh, Tyrone as well. He's been hanging out on a lot of the streams. Everyone watching back on the VODs or on YouTube, thank you, thank you. Stay safe, everyone. Happy Zero Ween. More horror games to come. More of this to come. And I'll see you all in the next video. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you so much. Till next time. Zero is the number. Lebonski.